The first way to get the dough fruit is from the Blocks Fruit Gacha. When you buy a fruit from the Blocks Fruit Gacha, you have a chance of getting any fruit, including the dough fruit. Dough is one of the more rarer fruits to get though. When you first start playing Blocks Fruits, you'll have to be level 50 to buy fruits from the Blocks Fruit dealer. The price will start at 32,000 but increase every time you level up. The second way to get the dough fruit is from the Blocks Fruit dealer. The Blocks Fruit dealer has a stock that changes every 4 hours and any fruit has a chance of being in it, including dough. But the dough fruit has a more rare chance of being in the stock than other fruits. All of the fruits have different prices too and dough costs 2,800,000 belly. But if you use your robux to buy the dough fruit from the stock or someone uses their robux to gift you the dough fruit from the stock you get the dough fruit permanently. Which means you can equip the dough fruit from the stock anytime you want for free. The third way to get the dough fruit is by trading. You can get the dough fruit by trading the fruit you have for a better fruit and that fruit for a better fruit and that fruit for an even better fruit. And you keep getting better and better fruits until you get the dough fruit. But that's harder than it sounds so another way to trade is by trading people game passes because depending on the game pass you have it can be really valuable. For example my cousins traded the 2 times money game pass for dough a bunch of times. To be able to trade game passes instead of buying it press gift and store in inventory. And whenever somebody trades you a game pass the game automatically makes you equip it so you can't trade it. The fourth way to get the dough fruit is by blocks fruit spawn locations. Blocks fruits have multiple spawn locations in each sea. And there's a chance of any fruit spawning, including the dough fruit. But once again, the dough fruit has a rarer chance of spawning than the other fruits. And if you buy the blocks fruit notifier game pass, you'll be told whenever a blocks fruit spawns and how close you are to it. I'll put a video in the description that shows all the blocks fruit spawn locations for each C. The fifth way to get the dough fruit is by factory raids. Factory raids only happen in the second C near the cafe, and you'll know what's about to happen when the chat says we are breaching the factory in 30 seconds. Whenever the race starts and you enter the factory, there's going to be a cord that you have to destroy and whoever does the most damage to the core gets a random fruit. And there's a chance of getting any fruit from that, including the dough fruit. But like before, you have a rarer chance of getting the dough fruit than the other fruits. The sixth way to get the dough fruit is by ship raids. Well actually, it isn't even a 100% chance that you'll even get a fruit after you finish a ship raid, so let's just skip this. And the seventh way to get the dough fruit is by pirate raids. Pirate raids only happen in the third sea at Castle on the Sea. You'll know the pirate raid's about to happen when the chat says pirates have been spotted approaching the castle. When the raid starts, a bunch of NPCs are going to spawn on Castle on the Sea that you're going to have to kill. While killing them, when an NPC was tanky at the end of his name spawns, you're going to have to kill it to get a fruit. And you have to be the one to kill him. If somebody else kills him, they get the fruit. And like I always say, there's a chance of getting any fruit, but the dough fruit has a more rare chance of getting than the other fruits. And that's how you get the dough fruit. You're welcome.